Welcome back to Capital Academy. Capital Academy is all about speaking with entrepreneurs who are startup companies and early stage companies as they're walking through the path of raising capital, getting involved with investors, finding other founders. From and that point, how did you feel about your presentation? How did you feel about pitching to begin with? And what are some of your thoughts for your next step? It was good. It was less nerve-wracking than I originally thought it would be, but um, I did learn a lot about how I should go next time and how direct I need to be. Uh, I think I need to simplify everything so that it's, it's much um, easier to And he is also an investor. And Demet, thank you so much <coughs> for participating in the Pitch Me. And I'd like to know for Tim if there's any thoughts that you might have on the Pitch Me that Tim was able to present today. So as we were talking at, during the break and, and also during your, your pitch, there was a lot of positives that I saw. I like the social consciousness that you're trying to bring to the process. But my biggest concern as a potential investor, and as I said, as a recovering attorney, mm -hmm. is the issue of Basically potential liabilities. Angie's List meets LinkedIn meets Match.com. Okay. So we're something that no matter what your transaction type is, you would be able to come uh, and establish a team uh, just to simplify the process, take away all of the, the unknowns, um, remove I, the chaos. I do see it to a small degree a disruption, but it's all in the way that they package it. Mm -hmm. I think if they package it as more of an informational it's about site. Exit strategy. Um, companies who are going into business, and especially when you are looking to um, bring in outside capital, it, it makes huge sense for you to understand the different exit strategies available, learn how to